Thyroid gland has two types of cells, follicular epithelial cell, parafollicular cells also called as C cells. Both of these are derived from endoderm. Follicular epithelial cell give rise to T3 and T4. T3 is also called triiodothyronine. T4 is also called as thyroxine. Parafollicular cells, C cells also gives rise to calcitonin. Synthesis of T3 and T4 Step 1. This is blood. This is thyroid follicular epithelial cell. Sodium and iodide ions from blood enters thyroid follicular epithelial cell through sodium iodide co-transporter. Here in thyroid follicular epithelial cell, thyroglobulin is synthesized from amino acid tyrosine. Step 2. This is thyroid follicular epithelial cell. This is thyroid follicular lumen. Here iodide ion enters thyroid follicular lumen and undergoes oxidation reaction which is catalyzed by thyroid peroxidase enzyme to give rise to iodine. Thyroglobulin also enters thyroid follicular lumen. Step 3. Iodine and thyroglobulin undergoes organification by thyroid peroxidase to give rise to a compound of, consisting of thyroglobulin, two molecules of monoiodotyrosine and two molecules of diiodotyrosine. This compound undergoes coupling reaction by thyroid peroxidase to give rise to thyroglobulin with one molecule of monoiodotyrosine, one molecule of diiodotyrosine, one T3 and one T4. Here T3 is formed from one molecule of monoiodotyrosine and one molecule of diiodotyrosine. Here T4 is formed from two molecules of diiodotyrosine. Step 4. This compound is taken up by thyroid follicular epithelial cell by endocytosis and undergoes degradation to form T3 and T4 which goes to the blood and monoiodotyrosine and diiodotyrosine which again undergoes degradation to form tyrosine. Step 5. T4 goes to the peripheral tissue and is converted to T3 by 5-diiodinase. T3 also goes to the peripheral tissue. Here T3 performs thyroid functions. Functions of thyroid hormones. Only triiodothyronine T3 which is free and unbound performs thyroid functions which are growth of bone, stimulates beta 1 receptors in heart, stimulates sodium potassium pump hence increases basal metabolic rate, maturation of brain, synthesis of surfactant. For all of this body needs energy hence T3 stimulates glycogenolysis and gluconeogenesis to increase blood sugar levels. Thyroid hormone regulation. Hypothalamus secretes thyrotropin releasing hormone. Thyrotropin releasing hormone stimulates anterior pituitary gland to secrete thyroid stimulating hormone. Thyroid stimulating hormone stimulates thyroid follicular cells to release T3 and T4. Inhibitors of thyroid hormones. Propyl thiouracil inhibits thyroid peroxidase and 5-D-iodinase. Methimazole inhibits thyroid peroxidase. T3 and T4 feedback inhibits hypothalamus and anterior pituitary. Glucocorticoids, somatostatin, dopamine all inhibit anterior pituitary gland. Thank you.